Hey, what's up, everyone? So, I'm going to be making this video today, basically, to tell you guys the most annoying parts of playing NBA 2K online. And, um, to start off, I think the most annoying part is that when you're playing blacktop, you're playing with random strangers. The game gives you random teammates and a random opponent. And it's three on three, blacktop. And the most annoying part is that it gives you players that you have no idea who they are. You have never seen them before. You have no idea what their playing style is like. You, you have no idea about their statistics or how good they are, any of that. You have no idea. So you're playing with these complete strangers and the game somehow just knows that it gives you terrible, terrible teammates when it knows your skill and if I play as a center so I'm always the big man now the game knows hey he's a big man let's give him terrible teammates to make it even against this really good team so I'm always getting stuck with these teammates that have no idea what's going on they have no idea how to play the game so that's probably one of the most frustrating things about that for me and I'm always up against this really skilled team that they're all Hall of Fame and I got these two really terrible point guards that still wearing their brown outfit you know and they're just like they have no idea and they're both ball hogs and they have no idea how to play the game I'm a Hall of Fame center so I'm like, come on now. And the game does this to me all the time. And so I've lost many games because my teammates have no idea what, what they're doing. They have no idea. And so that's frustrating. And, and the, one of the most annoying pet peeves is that when a point guard says they're good, but they don't pass it at the right timing like they see they see the play right and they they do pass it eventually but they don't pass it at the right time you know when you're a point guard you have to have that right timing to pass that perfect you know that perfect pass and it I'm always getting stuck with point guards that don't know what perfect timing is. They they don't have that that same feel as it as you know as a center. I know when the right timing for the pass is. So they don't, they pass it a little like a half a second too late, and it gets blocked. And I'm like, dude, come on now. I'm a center, and I should know when you should pass it. And I. I and you know a point guard should know so that's frustrating you know and also I think one of the most annoying things about this game nowadays is that everyone is swiping the ball they're button mashing the ball um, to swipe the ball away and if you're trying to make a pass it's gonna be deflected 90 percent of the time and, and it's not just for the center. I think it's just for the... Um, as for everyone else. Not just center. It's small forwards. It's point guards. It's power forwards. It's every position. And everyone is swiping the ball. Well, they're constantly mashing that button to swipe it. And I'm like, I can't even play a game without people trying to swipe it out of everyone's hands. I mean, that's no fun. That's, it's like, come on, use a strategy. Play the game like a regular game without button mashing and trying to hack the game. 
it's stupid. I mean, I just, I don't know. It's very frustrating. So, that's that. That's that. Um, yeah, I don't know. I just, I just, I don't, I don't want to play all the time because, like, it's, like, why are you going to play if, I mean, if it's frustrating you. So, um, I also have a, a shooting guard that I use every now and then. I don't, I don't really like the shooting guard because I, it's, I don't, it's too simple. It, it's just way too simple. It's, um, all, all I do with the shooting guard is to shoot the ball. He's a three-point specialist, so all basically I do with him is stay at the three-point line and shoot threes. Um, so, um, I've been trying to get a little bit more complicated with the guy. It's like, there's only so far you can go. I mean, you can have lockdown defense. Okay, yeah, you got that down. Now what? You work on the offense. I already know defense. I mean, because... I play as a center, that's my main guy. So defense is basically the main thing with him. So I've I've really gotten down on defense, but it's the offense that on my shooting guard. My center, I've I've done offense with him just fine. I have no problem. I'm making eleven points a game with twelve rebounds. I mean it's good. So with the shooting guard, it's kinda bad because he's like six foot five. And I mean I don't know. He, he's just not as spectacular, I guess. He's not as unique and different. Because you see shooting guards and point guards all the time in the game. And you don't really focus much on, I mean, making it really spectacular. I mean, there's so far you can go with it, right? So, um, I try to mix it up. But my center really is the one to, he's really one of the best there is. So... I've gone up against all the great centers. I've gone up against them, and they're all basically the same. They got good defense. I mean, they just, they got good D. Some some of the great centers can shoot threes. I, mine can as well. I got post moves. I got defense. I can shoot threes. Mid range game. You got you name it all. I got it. So, um, but it's frustrating when your teammates have no idea how to play, and that's the worst part. That's absolutely the most annoying part. So, I just hope that the game plays right next time. Like, I know I can play crew, but I hate crew because no one knows how to make a good customized uniform, basically. And I, I want my guy to have his custom clothes. And when you're playing crew, you can't have custom clothes. You have to have that uniform. And crew, I mean, I know you wouldn't go up against computers and everything. And you won't have bad teammates. But still, I mean, like, it's frustrating. I don't like crew. It's boring. It's, I don't know, it's just not my thing. Um, and that's another thing. You know, when you play as a center so much, you always get caught up against facing a computer because there there aren't many centers out there playing as a center so I'm always getting locked up with a uh, power forward or a computer which is a center and it's really frustrating because centers have lockdown defense no matter what you do once you get the ball the computer is going to find a way to somehow block you or take all your offensive abilities and just wipe them clean so that's really frustrating because I mean when you're a center you want to go up against another human you know um, but I know humans are too easy so that's why I go up against computers a lot to test how good I am <laughs> um, so yeah that's that so I really hope 2k really improves its gameplay and their servers, their servers are horrible. So, all right, talk to you later.